When you get your first salary of uh, thousands of dollars, uh, you feel like you are the king of the world. Finally, it's time to live independently. I am on my own boss now. The thousand bucks seems a lot because uh, a month ago you had nothing. Uh, you are no longer ask your mom for the money on the hangout. You are now independent. Soon uh, you will uh, be achieving uh, your huge plans uh, that you have been uh, thinking uh, over for for years. However, after some time you start uh, to change. Your needs uh, begins to grow. So you no longer want to move around in a public transport. The idea of the memory being a full kind of seems uh, too simple. Thankfully you got a uh, promotions so now you are making uh, $1,500 uh, dollars a month. Uh, finally you can uh, drink uh, something more expensive, you can eat uh, more often outside, maybe you can even take a cab inside uh, of being lost in a crowd. Um, by the way, uh, what you, uh, what about your phone? Uh, you need Apple uh, flash and, uh, uh, flag signs uh, since your iPhone 8 uh, is too old already, especially with a salary of 2000 bucks uh, and other promotions. And uh, shouldn't be a problem. Yes, the price uh, tax uh, it is a little too high and uh, you will need to take a loan, uh, but man, the applications uh, will uh, be the milliseconds uh, faster so the uh, gamers uh, the games will run a little smoother and uh, your 47 followers on instagram will definitely appreciate that uh, slightly better camera at some point you start to notice that your salary has doubted uh, but your wife didn't uh, you still work in the same place, uh, do the same things, you start feeling like you are not making enough. You even start uh, borrowing money, but what's the problem? You are now making more money and yet you feel like you are got poor. Uh, poor. You had uh, a dream once, uh, travel, see the world, uh, meet different people, learn to speak a new language, dance. And with more money, you should have more opportunities to experience that. But it feels uh, the other way around. Maybe you should uh, make even more, then you will definitely be happy and realize, uh, and realize your dream. But I want to ask you, what do you think you really need? More money? The truth is that successful lifestyles leads to the person to endless cycles of uh, uh, expenses without being able to save. With a higher salary, you will buy the exact same things but a little bit more expensive. You will buy slightly better food uh, courses uh, and uh, you will grab a cab uh, instead of the bus. Uh, that's uh, what uh, consum uh, consumerism is uh, all about. It's a strategy that's uh, used by the companies to drain every penny out of you. Can you answer these questions honestly? How much money do you really need in a month? You haven't uh, thought about that. That's uh, precisely why uh, a job is the modern uh, slavery for you. However, you can uh, use it uh, to get your freedom. Before you achieve the practical goal, you must first see it. And here you have to follow the rule of 4%. Wherever the amount of the money you need, uh, 30000 dollars uh, divided by 4%, uh, this is how much you should save. The stock market grows an average rate 7% adjusted to inflation. So if you invest uh, 750000 dollars you can withward uh, thirty thousand dollars every year and your investments will still be growing that's uh, what uh, passive income really is you will no longer have to live in the specific place work in a job uh, that uh, you hate you can simply do whatever you want uh, for the rest of your life because your passions uh, income your passive income has your back you can still work but only if you love it and that's what financial freedom is so whatever exactly should you start step one check your expenses and find out how much uh, price you spend step two figure out which uh, categories can you optimize if you spend 150 bucks on the sweets on a month five dollars here another seven there they uh, add up uh, stop that step three fix the amount uh, that uh, you want to save so 
that you have a clear idea of how much money you spend and uh, how much uh, put uh, under your pillow. Of course, you have um, emergencies, but not every single month. Therefore, be rational. Now, the question is, uh, what should you do with these savings? I can see two options. Option one, you can invest uh, through uh, investment funds, uh, which is a company that invites uh, in the hundreds of the other companies and that's the best options for the most people. Option number two, however, if you are willing to take uh, it uh, to the next level, so you can create your investment portfolio where you will invest um, individual companies such as Google, Amazon, Facebook. I have made uh, multiple videos on the stocks market so you can check them out uh, for future details. This strategy is uh, one of uh, is uh, of course not going to make sense uh, in the short run but in the five years for example you can build the stable passive incomes uh, of the few thousand dollars a month and uh, retire it's mostly going to depend on how hard you are willing to Hustle. Are you going to save twenty percent of your income, or you will go uh, you will go hard and save sixty percent? You are the one who will decide. Um, consumerism uh, or financial freedoms.